Hello everyone, my name is Wolf Down the Gamer, and today we're gonna play another episode of Frambo. Last time we fell into mysterious land. We were able to rescue Mr. Midnight with no problems this time, and play a little bit of Frogger. But other than that, we we're now somewhere else. Okay, I, I gotta continue. Okay, we're now in some land. Okay, there's lots of clothes. Hmm. These are French stockings. And one of French shoes. Hmm. French shoe. Oh, uh, wait a minute. What's this? What the? Ah! What a great tree! I'll scratch you, you thing. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's creepy. Kitty! Kitty! Stop it! What are you talking about? Friend? My dolly! Is that you? It can't be! Oh, it can't be, alright? She turned into a goddamn tree. What is it, my dear? Of course it's me. Who else could I would I be? Friend, you are a tree. Don't be silly. Help me get up. Oh man. Wait just a second. Where are my hands? Why can't I move? <laughs> oh my god. I'm telling you, my dear. You have become a tree. <laughs> okay, this is so this is ridiculous now. <laughs> what? But how? Oh my dear. This is, was the end of a line. The big monster did this. I know it, Kitty. He won't let us go home. I hope he, hope he won't come back. He was very scary. He always comes back. I think I remembered him from that night. The night Mom and Dad died. Kitty, I don't want to talk about it. I just want to go home. But you are a tree, my friend. A tree. I can't carry you all the way back home. Besides, I'm not sure where we are or either. Am I going to die, Kitty? Tell me. Friend, you look fine. Well, you're a tree, yes, but... Please don't say that, friend. Don't leave me. But I feel so weak. Huh? Oh, now what? Um, hookah, ignu, hula. Kale kale ang nama. Pasar hani. Ignu joka, bante. Oh, now what? Attack of the vegetables? Ah, be careful, sir. Why are you attacking me? Could you please tell me where I am, sir? Hula hula. Stop it. I'll scratch you. Hula rog What are they saying? Oh, my kitty. What is happening to us? Hula. Stop attacking me, please. I mean no harm. Hula day. Kitty, help me. Find my purse, please. Maybe I can do something about this. I'll see what I can do, friend. Okay, now we're in a situation. We got, we have, we have a talking, a, a vestibule pointing a, a stick thing at Fran, who, who's now turned into a tree. And we got this way. I mean, person, I don't even know who the fuck he is. Stop attacking my friend, Carrot. I don't care. To me, look, he looks like, he looks like a veg. I don't know what he is. Old vegetable stay on the boat. But I can't get on a boat. I don't think I can. Hmm. What a strange shape. What is it? Okay, now we got... Okay, we got gears. Okay, there's the purse, but... Unfortunately, we need to do something. I have seen some mechanics. They circulate. Okay, I can get the... Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Okay, try it. Shit. Maybe I need to... Why won't it... Okay, what's these? Oh, I'll take the stone. It's shiny. Okay, put it next to the gears. Maybe we'll... Put it on the fucking thing. What the hell? I have a stone. Okay, maybe I'm supposed to do something. Is there anything back here? Okay. Maybe I'm supposed to throw something at it. Can I throw it? You. Oh, okay. I'm supposed to click on. The okay. Actually, okay. Before we do that, we should probably. I can't do that. I okay, I'm. Logs. Okay, we put that there. Now we get the fucking purse. I got the purse only because I'm the best. Yeah, you are, Mr. Minnat. You are the best. <laughs> Look at this goofy picture. I like it. Okay. Uh, what do I do? Okay, I, can't, I don't think the book will be useful. So how about this? How about we use it on... Okay, let's get the picture. Oh, why, are, why is your eyes closed? 
it won't work. Okay. Okay, maybe I have to show it to the dude. Dude! Help me! You cook a... Ah! Rumus! Huh? Why are you taking me, sir, vegetable? They want to help you, friend. I can feel it. Ink wooga, apple. Don't be afraid, my friend. Kitty, stop them, please. Don't leave me. I will be right here with you. Gummer, Gumra. Wee. Okay. All right. Now we save. We pretty much chapter three, vegetative state that we're in right now. Or. Pretty much just to be changed into tree state. What the? Amigbunuskar bra zire numla umba mmm berries. Amishwa impom guska entan il fulla guska zero. Welcome, creature. My name is Zyre. Do you speak human? Oh my goodness, yes! Finally! Words I understand! My good friend Ryle told me that you show me an illustration with four humans and a cat. I assume you are one of them, the little girl. Please forgive my good friend if he scared you. We have never seen a human looking like a tree before. Oh man, what should I do in my case? Eh, explain. Yes, let me explain it to you. Oh, no need to speak, my child. The seed will show me everything. Up to Moscow, Uncle. I take bro. I take pro. That's a fudge. That's weird. Okay, yeah, that is messed up. Okay, now you have magical voodoo powers. Hmm, let me see. Ooh, you can appear in this sea to, to look at the earthly truth. You are good, no doubt about it. A seeker of the truth. Very common of the bow family tree. Oh, your name is Fran. You're the girl with the passion for life. I see great love towards this little creature standing next to you. A cat, protector of gates. Interesting. Can you see all that in the seed? Be quiet. I see something else. The seed doesn't hide everything. I see a world nobody should see. No one. Nobody. Except for me. What do you mean by except for one? You mean the monster? You're not supposed to be here, Fran. That is the only thing I can tell you, my child. I don't want to be here. I want to go home. We can't let you leave now. It's too dangerous for us. You should never have been aware of our existence. There must be a way. Am I dead or something? Dead? What do you mean by that? You know, when you no longer exist? Or when you get killed by a freaking ass. Besides, it's not normal to be a tree. I must be dead. Death is nothing more but than the absence of love. Once you can't feel love, you die. Even even if your body still walks. Okay. Then I'm not dead. You have to help me get back home. Little cat, come closer. Let me see. What is your name? I may have missed my name is Mr. Midnight. That is indeed a very pretty name. Do you think Fran should go back home? Yes, I do, sir. Show us the way back home. I implore you. Ah, I have a question. Are you the king? Ah oh, ha ha, you are hilarious. Yes, I am the king. The king of Istra. Oh, what an honor, your highness. By the way, I like your leaves. They are pretty. King, sir, please, will you help me? Why is this need of you going home so great? The sea told me your story. You don't have much to go back to. There is many reasons, sir. But the most important thing is my aunt. She will protect me. I want to feel that someone cares about me. I feel confused almost all the time. I want to be somewhere where I feel home, sir. I see. You are very brave. I just want to go home. Please, help me. There are things I cannot do, but I will help you. I will lead you to the door that will take you home. But it is your own task, Quaffer. 
Oh, really? Oh, thank you so much. And where's this door, sir? We'll talk about that later. First things first, you must be able to talk and walk on this land. Yes, sir. That would be very great. I'm afraid I won't be able to bring your human body back. Only the great wizard can do that. But we'll talk more about him after the procedure. You must first understand our language. But how will I understand your every single language? Eat this fruit. Mmm, fruit. Yeah, I want to eat that. Oh, textbook shot. Your ears and tongue will be able to understand. But not only your eyes. That means you won't be able to read. Oh, wait. It means I can't read? Don't worry about that. I can always ask. Excuse me. Do you understand what I say, human lady? Yes, I do. You sound so kind. This is incredible. Do you understand, my kitty? I didn't, you highness. I demand one fruit for myself. You don't need the fruit, Mr. Midnight. Our land is based on fragrances and sound. You'll see everything as your own real dairy suit. No doubt about that. You'll do fine, Kitty. And sir, do you know why I became a tree? I want to know. Yes, but I don't think I'm the right one to give you the answers. Now, it's time for the procedure. Are you afraid of heights? Mm -hmm. Well, it depends on the height. Why? Take her upstairs immediately. What are you taking me? What are you gonna do to me? To get some arms and legs, everything will be fine. I'll be waiting for you, friend. I love you. Uh, okay, creep, baby. All right. Ow, my hip hurts. Mmm, where are we? Wow, I like this. I like this is the best looking. This is the best looking chapter in the entire game. <gasps> Whoa, <gasps> is that Elcor the dragon? It is Elcor. Looks like a good day. My name is Pari Polantars, and I'm your doctor today, at your humble service. Are you the emergency case? Wow, amazing. What a huge, beautiful, fluffy thing. Excuse me? Oh, I'm sorry. It's just that I've never seen anything like you before. I'm still trying to understand that all of this is real. My name is Fran. I'm a human girl. The king sent me here to get some arms and legs so I can go home. Oh, a human? I think we can get you a pair of arms and legs. But we have to travel a bit, a, a little bit further in order to fix that. Are you ready to enter the paws of the beast? What beast? Me, I'm the beast. Let's go. Oh, great. Whoa. <laughs> I, would, I would definitely say that's a cool design. I wonder if it's strawberry lemonade in there. Here we are. Wow, this place is so beautiful and peaceful. I wish I could be there forever. Thank you. This is my home. This is where I was born. Mmm, doesn't look like much. Doesn't look like much for you, kid. I mean, Corvus. Oh, that's nice. The sky. There's a a beautiful tree and a. I don't know where that water's coming from, but I don't want to know. But anyway, this ashes. The spirit of the great Voltros created it. It has the purest water in the whole universe. Oh, wow. That sounds amazing. Hmm. I'm curious about this. Who is the great Voltros? Volkocross. Haven't you heard about the five realities? He is the king of the first reality. A long time ago, he was at war with the darkness. And one day, he fell. He fell so badly, his heart was broken. He was all alone. But he came to Istra, and his blood made this one pink. That is why it's so pure. It's a very long story. Okay. Wow, that sounds grand. I mean, I didn't know about other realities. And how is it that you're here? What brought you to Istra? My kitty and I were on our way back home. I was so happy to see him and hug him again, but then we fell. The big monster that follows me did this. He broke the bridge, and he wants he wants me dead. Who will like wait to see you dead? That sounds terrible. I prefer not to talk about this. But so, Doctor, do you know why I became a tree? Yes, sometimes our wishes are so strong that they became true. You do this in order to keep yourself alive. Think about this way. Your human body was destroyed. But you wanted to keep being friend. You wanted to keep your life. So you took on this empty shell to maintain all your precious memories within with you. 
It's actually the first time I've seen a human using the tree as a chrysalis. But it's dangerous to have him here. It makes our land vulnerable. I did this to myself. Well, but Horizon, sir. How? I didn't know I was doing anything. You really did not know what you're doing. Well, I see. When you travel to Ushua, you open the door between reality and your reality and ours. And with this door open, unexpected creatures can also enter our reality. And that happens. The balance will be tainted. Okay, so pretty much it's a it's a moral balance. And there is only one who would like to see the poison the second reality. The monster. The terrible black. Oh, don't cry, bro. I can't see this happen again. I just can't. Don't be sad, Doctor. I'm very sorry for what I did. I didn't mean to. Oh, little girl, you're so nice. And you don't have anything to be sorry for. I think you're very special. Well, let's concentrate on your arms and legs, alright? Hmm, yes, Doctor. Soldier of the Sun, Spirit of the Water, give Fran her arms and legs. How do you think? How do you feel, Fram from Ustra? Well, I feel like a beautiful tree. I have leaves! But hang. I'm glad you like it. I told you we would fix it. This war is magical. It can fix anything. Anything? Do you, do you, do you think it'll fix my mommy and daddy? What do you mean, fix them? What's wrong with them? Nothing, Doctor. Thank you very, thank you very much for helping me. You're the best doctor I ever had. And you're fluffy and beautiful. I have an argument for her. His name was Dr. Dern, but he was the evil old man, and a fucking drug and a fucking pedophile, so fuck him! The old man? Hmm. I bet he wasn't that bad. Fuck you! Maybe he was following his phone rules. Let's go now. I'll leave you at the station. They're flying. Hmm. Man. He reminds me of the, of Elagor. Wow. Here we are again. Show Zero the King what a nice inters it's as you you become. Thank you again, Doctor. You have to meet my kitty someday. That'll be lovely. I'll see you soon. Goodbye. Okay, there's nothing here we can do. So let's get out of here. You fluffy kitty. Oh you like that. <laughs> here I am. Friend my dear. You got leaves on your head. How pretty. Oh, let me see you. What a great Osh Interstrain how you became. Come, sorry. Thank you, King Sir. The doctor was incredible. He made magic with the water. But he was sad. He told me many things I didn't quite understand. Don't worry. Forest will be fine. I know the reasons. We have some problems to solve, but that's nothing you should worry about. Let's talk about how you can get back home, right? Yes, please. You said something about a great wizard. Yes, the Great Wizard is the only one who's able to bring your human body back. And he has the stones that can open the door that will lead you home. Where is the wizard? What stones? This land is full of things I don't understand. Ha ha, you haven't even gone outside this castle and you already want to know everything. That's the passion I was talking about. Have patience, Fran. The Great Wizard lives in the Great Mountain Corum. But we haven't seen him in quite a while now. Find him and everything will be just fine. Why have you have you tried to find a great wizard yourself? Well, we don't need to. It's very logical. You see, we don't need a wizard to perform magic or prepare potions. We can do that ourselves. The wizard's most valuable task is to protect the stones that open the door. I see, so the stones are like keys, and where's this mountain you said? You have to ask around. Follow the signs. I have to go now. But I'll be back in time to help you with the door. Have a great Ursula day, and good luck finding the great wizard. Oh, there's, Pro there's Protius. Okay. Wow. Do you see that huge fluffy creature? That's Protius. He fixed me. Yes, it's certainly fluffy. Oh, I forgot. Here's her purse. Yay, my purse is back. Oh, thank you, kitty. Do you see my pills everywhere? I don't think so. Maybe they're on the other side of the lake, next to your clothes. Hmm. Well, we have other things to do anyway. We have to find the wizard. Yes, the king says something about a mountain, too. Yes, mountain, mountain Corum. The great list lives there. Let's go. Okay. What? I don't know if I should read this. Hmm. I don't know if I want to read this. Eh, not now at least. 
until we all really later since we get our body back. That's probably a good idea. And then uh, talk to the beetle. No, no, you can't get in. It's closed. Oh, closed? I didn't know. What's behind this passage? Well, the library, of course, but it's closed. Come back in fall or winter, then we'll be open. Hey, aren't you the talking tree I talked to, to see, Price? Yes, that's me. Price gave me arms and legs. Yes, and also a head. That's very positive. Hey, <laughs> yes. But why is the library closed, sir? Well, that's logic. The sun goes down a second move, sir. We open. Only then the real knowledge will be learned. And that only happens in the fall or winter. Oh, so you don't learn anything while you're in summer or spring. Of course we learn. We learn all the time. I'm learning now that you like to ask many questions. Mmm. Screw it. I think I have to get going. I need to find my way back home. Bye. Alright, so we can't go in there. I don't know what it is. Okay, let's go in here. Let's go in there. Wow, this is amazing. Hmm. Alright, so the flag. We got a sign. Oh wow, I don't understand. I can't understand the fucking language, that's what. Okay, so I can't. I can go down here. Hmm. There's some. Looks like a map. Let's try the map. Okay, that must be Mount Crudum. That's where we got arms and legs that Propius took us. So let's try to go. Let's go this way. Gotta be kidding me. What's this thing? This is a very odd clock. Okay. Alright. What's in here? Hmm. Don't see anything here. Let's talk to this glass up. Hello. Good day, living creature. All good. Yes, I'm fine. What are you doing? I'm smelling this flower. Beautiful creation. Mmm. Uh, oh, crap. Uh, are you waiting for somebody? I'm waiting for the lemons to grow. Do you like lemons? They're a bit sour for my taste, but lemonade is yummy. Lemonade is what I do with lemons for the customers of the bar, you know. And when we put our stuff inside, too, so we can fly. Why? Wow, I want to try that. That sounds great. Yeah, that's why I wait. You can't rush it. Hey, the bar opens in the fall and a very awesome dancer will form. You should come and you should come and hang out. Maybe I will. Sounds fun. Thank you. Bye. Okay, so we gotta find the mountain. Okay, there's a board. What's this? Looks like a tree. Okay. I wanna go up here. Alright, so we gotta find this mountain. I think this is it. Okay, let's go up here. I see a rock. Okay, so it's not this one. So let's go in here. It's nothing here but trees and flowers. Okay, so that's not it. Where the frick is it? Alright, what's in here then? Hmm. I can't understand. Alright. Oh! Um, hello there, mysterious ghost ladies. Oh, wow, what are you? Look at the fairies in my books. The purest of feelings, the light of all material. We are Volkas. Oh, you are very shiny, and you may feel so happy. So very happy. Look, creature, one of the young Volkas will receive the shield. Omakame, Polo Gro, Omakame, Gran! Soldier of the sun, creature from the soil, fruit from the seed. Let the universe illuminate you, the truth, and be free. Huh? Where are you all going? We continue our paths to life. May freedom be with you, my friend. Sir, or miss, hmm, can you do magical things? The universe is already doing magic all the time. You are full of magic yourself. But I wish to know things, it's, and it's odd. I feel like you know everything. We are, the, we are the light. We are everywhere. What answers are you looking for? I want to know who killed my parents and why that big monster is hunting me. The truth will come to those who seek. Your path is towards. Truth is enmeshed. You are living in a world that turns its back on you. 
You are too fragile to face the truth just now, and too strong to let it go. But... Dear, don't be sad. We have to keep on going. Yes, Kitty, you're right. There's something I can grab. Okay, let's try to... Uh, crud, move gears. Oh my god. Uh, no, I'm not going for that puzzle. Hell no. Okay, so we gotta find the wizard. Where are you? We're gonna see the wizard, the one wizard of Ushara. We're gonna cure him. We're gonna transform back into a human anyway. We're off to see. Oh, it's over there. Hmm, I'd like to borrow that boat. No, we can't take. Damn it. Okay, so we have to go this way. Okay, so we're going this way then. We're off to see the wizard. Ooh, blacksmith. And a shop. Mm. Okay, and I'm not gonna talk to everyone here. We want we want to focus on finding the wizard. Uh, okay. Okay, let's see what we got here. Hmm, I can't hear things. Well, I'm not. I'm not worried. Is there anything on that boat we can borrow? I'm boat ready to depart. Let's talk to him. Good day, sir. Good day, little creature. I have I've seen fine boats, sir. How does that work? Think about them flowing in water, but instead of water, it's air. It's so simple. And can I borrow one of your boats to fly away? I want to go home. Oh, go home, you see. Sally, these boats only work on a string. Huh, I see. Well, thank you, sir. Have fun making your boat. Uh gotta figure out what to do. Hello, Root. You're so cute. Oh, thank you. You're cute, too. He, I'm Fran. And you? Me? No, I'm not Fran. I'm Zima. And I want to sing all day long. He, he. What's your favorite song? My favorite song goes like this. One and one are two. One, one. One and two are three. Two and three are five. And three and five are eight. And I don't remember any more than that. I learned that at school. It's fine. Oh, that sounds very mathematical. I have to go now. You're very... You have good proofs, by the way. See you. Uh, we are freaking lost. There's gotta be a way. Let's talk to him. Maybe, maybe you can tell him. Where the lizard? Hello. What are you doing? Hmm. Working on my clock. Oh, I see. Sir, do you know where I can find the great wizard? No, miss, I do clocks. I fix clocks. I listen to clocks. Tick tock. Hmm. Do you know what the mountain chrome is? The mountain chrome only exists in winter time. Otherwise, it's just regular mountain. Fuck. I can't wait for winter. I can't say what wizard would be mountain chrome. You don't need to wait for winter to come. That's a cert. Time is infinite. Is a infinite layer of reality. Oh, a layer of reality. That sounds great. What should I do then? Go to the big clock and change the city. Just change it. Oh, you mean that little clock thing. Where is the clock? Well, go towards the castle, but turn to the left when you see the stairs. You'll find a big clock on the tree. Good luck. Thank you, sir. You're very nice. Bye. Okay, so now we need to... So apparently the clock is on hibernation period, so we got... Okay, so we think... I think that clock right there is the one we need. Oh, wait, is this thing? Oh, hi. Hmm. Alright, I wanna do something with this clock. Okay. Broke? Shit! Damn it! Oh, wait, let's see, what's on the left? Damn it! How am I supposed to fix this stupid thing? It broke! Alright, trying to figure out what I need. Gotta be a way to fix the damn thing. Okay. I'll keep it fucking exploring until I find something. Or until something happens. I don't know. Where which one, where, where which one comes first? Okay, let's try to... I want to see this puzzle. I don't know what it does. I don't know what that does. I'm serious. I don't know what it does. Yeah, I'm, I'm a little confused now. Great. Ugh. All right. I found the okay. I found what looks appears to be a clock, but it's fucking broken. Wait, do I have anything to fix it with? 
Hmm. Let's see, we got a knife thing. Actually, use. Try using a knife. There's got to be a way to fix it. So, okay, now it can't be done. I need a gear! I need to find a fucking gear. Oh, great. Alright, so we're going to talk to Mr. Actually, let's talk to Blacksmith. Maybe he, can, maybe he can help us. Hello, I'm Fred. What are you doing? Good day. I'm Pooter, and I'm on this piece of iron. Oh, for what? I have to deliver a few clock pieces to a clockmaker. Oh, I see. You can, you can do all types of me metallic stuff? Sure. If you have some ideas, we can talk about them and PAMO! I do it. That's very good to know. Thank you, sir. Well, I have to keep working, but if you need my services, you know where I am. Let's talk to him again. Okay. Yeah, same. It repeats. Uh, fucking Christ. I need... Yeah, I am fucking lost. Okay, talk to the clock here again. Maybe I can ask. I can talk to him. Okay, sir, I have a little problem. Hmm, yes, I don't have any. The big clock on the tree, it's broken. I can't make it work. Please help me. I broke clock. That's a disgrace. Poor clock. You have to help me. Please fix it for me. I beg you, I have to go home. I never fix clocks for nothing. Otherwise, my life goes time to waste. What do you mean? I, cha I charge one golden coin per clock. Time is going now. I don't have any coins. Hmm, then no clock will ever be fixed. Please, sir, as a favor, I need to go home. I can't help you then. Bring me a golden coin or nothing will be fixed. I see. Thank you. I'll see if I can get some gold for you. Bye. Okay, I think we'll stop here for today. Okay, that's it for today, folks. This is actually pretty interesting. Already, we're discovering a bit more history. The five realities. And... So, I guess we'll have to... Like I said, I'll... I'll probably do, use a walkthrough in the next part. But anyway... But anyway, if you enjoyed this series, then be sure to like, comment, check out my other parts of this of this series I'm doing. I appreciate it. And also, be sure to subscribe for more fantastic videos. And have a fantastic day. Bye-bye.